Today, our sea level check emergency update takes us to India. Our first stop is to the city of Tutukuri on the southern tip near Sri Lanka. Known as the Pearl City for its pearl fishing, Tutukuri is home to about 340,000 inhabitants. The sea level record goes back to 1964, according to the NOAA website. And the record shows that sea levels are rising at an annual rate of 0.54 millimeters a year. That's right. A century from now, Tutukuri can expect sea level to rise by 0.18 feet. That's 5.48 centimeters for you metric folks. Citizens of Tutukuri are strongly advised to ignore climate experts and enjoy life by the sea. Next, we head northeast to Diamond Harbor in the state of Bengal in the Ganges Delta. Archaeological evidence indicate human habitation in the area more than 2,000 years ago. Today, Diamond Harbor is home to 42,000 people. The sea level record goes back to 1948, according to the NOAA website. And the sea level record shows that sea levels are rising at an annual rate of 3.95 millimeters a year. The fastest yet on our sea level check videos. But even at that rate, a century from now, Diamond Harbor can expect sea level rise of 1.30 feet. That's 39.62 centimeters for you metric folks. The good people of Diamond Harbor are encouraged to stay calm and whistle a happy tune until further updates become available from the climate scientists. Our final stop takes us 1,200 miles west to Mumbai the most populous metropolitan region in India with over 23 million inhabitants. The sea level record goes all the way back to 1878, according to the NOAA website. And the record shows that sea levels are rising at an annual rate of 0.8 millimeters a year. That's right. A century from now, residents of Mumbai can expect sea level rise of 0.26 feet. That's 7.92 centimeters for you metric folks. Owners of seaside property are strongly advised to stay where they are, put your feet up, and enjoy a refreshing glass of Nimbu Pani, or Indian lemonade. This has been your sea level check emergency update. Always take the high road, and from the city of Mumbai, JJ Carr.